tricky, can be difficult, can be complicated as an exam. I remember way back when we were still in school, examination time could come and every time we would get out of an exam. Most of us had complaints. Eh, did you see what that guy said? Actually, I think that guy wants us to fail. That's his intention. He told us he's going to set this subject, this subject, this subject. He didn't set any of those. We had prepared, we had discussed, we had read those words, but he didn't set them. Hmm? We used to have a lot of complaints after exams, even before results come out. <laughs> Yet, bright students never used to even talk about, anything, about the exam after doing it. They just pick their bags and leave. Why? They researched enough. They prepared themselves enough. They used to prepare themselves even before the examination timetable. Well, as the weak students hmm, used to wait for the examination timetable to be pinned, then we rush into our books like, like the books were stolen from us. Hmm, and we've just received them. You find that bright students always they never used to be happy or excited when the teacher misses class. Yet we, the weak students, used to be so excited because we are going to jazz for two and a half hours. Hmm? No one is going to stop us because the teacher has missed. Bright students used to use that time to discuss. I didn't understand this. Actually, they used to connect. Bright students used to connect with themselves among themselves so they, they, they could check. I, I, I didn't understand this lesson, this, this subject. Bright students used to use that time to discuss the things they did not understand. They used to use that time to revise. For us, we used that time to, 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 to jazz, to relax, to talk about ourselves and the teachers and everything. That's life. Successful people don't have time to even com complain or comment about things that are happening around. No, they're too busy that they don't even have time for themselves. Yet losers, huh? they have a lot of time on them. A lot of time to discuss and comment about everything that's happening in the country. That's life. That's life. Losers, they connect with losers. They know, they, they have their jazz. They always have their things to talk about. And successful people connect. They have their circles. Because they know they need each other. Each and every, they know if I meet these people, they add something onto my plate. So they connect, they have, they keep their circles so small. Yet losers, I they have a lot of things to talk about. They comment about everything. They want to meet and talk about COVID. They want, <laughs> they want to, to, to meet and talk about the, co the, the, the fake COVID results. Successful people don't have time. They are working even through COVID. They are thinking, they are thinking ahead, COVID. So I try as much as I can not to be a loser. I may not be there yet. But I am on my way there. I am preparing my mind. Because I am going to get there. I don't want to act like a loser. No. No. So I also don't have time. Hmm? I'm, I'm, I want to be like them. I want to copy their strategies. I want to copy. So. In life. If you want to be successful. Behave like them. Act like them, learn from them, connect with them. Otherwise, that has been life with me. It, ha it, has, it can be tricky, it can be difficult, it can be complicated, like an exam. That has been Wisdom Kit with Elma. Please subscribe to my channel for more of these and leave your comment in the comment section below. I'll be closely following and I'll reply. Thank you very much. Till next time. Bye.